Hey guys, we have Kate playing Black Ops here. With Kate playing Black Ops. Screen's a little bit blurry because my camera. Say hi, Kate. Hi. Um. I don't know if my face is on it correctly because it was clipping out the other day when I made a video. Couldn't post it because it's too glitchy. Fabulous charger. Whoa. Um. Okay, I'm going to be reading Shasky by me, because I love making creep pastas oh in my spare time. And you're going to be hearing like, oh my god, in the middle of it, because she's playing that. Okay, Shasky stood out her window waiting for her bully to come home. She, so she sometimes liked to watch her bully from her bedroom window at night time. It made her feel, I don't know, special. She lived with her dad and her brother Henry. She's 13 oh, years old. She's 13 years old. Had blue eyes. Blue eyes, black hair. She mostly wore a, a I Heart No One t-shirt with, with a grey heart. And the and the writing's white and the background's black. A wristband saying I, I love myself. And blue jeans. And blue shoes. When she went to... When, at 4 o'clock... She went to go. She went to go stalk her bully outside their bedroom window. She stole into the window hard enough for the bully to notice her, but since the bully was too stupid, she couldn't. She, she Shasky heard a twig break behind her. What the hell is that? She said, with with confidence in her voice, sort of, because she was scared and hoping that she wouldn't get stabbed by some lame psychopath. Well, well, well. A, ma a tall man with black hair, as, as black as, um, as black as that carpet. <laughs> Red cuts on his face, wearing a white tracksuit, holding a knife, said. He, he punched a knife right into her stomach, causing her to fall inside down down the wall she couldn't she couldn't remember a thing until she got out of hospital her and her brother had were going into school she had a bandage around her hip and emily the bully she was stalking came over to her when she was getting her books kicked her in the teeth and shoved her she ran shasky ran into the bathroom crying she had contacts black ones for some reason she tore out her irises, put the contacts on, and shouted, Oh, how I felt. She ran into class. Everyone looked at her. They didn't, they didn't notice about her, her eyes. She sat at her desk, staring at Emily with annoyance. The, the fire bell went off. Always an excuse for school to be dismissed. The, Kaylee Shasky was walking home. With, she had no friends. She always carried a scalpel around with her for some reason. Instead of going home, she, she went to the woods. She sat. She sat near a tree. She sat near a tree, and and carved the words into the tree. Oh, how I felt. She she went home. And drew a pic, a drew on on a mask. She she painted it grey, did the outlines of the eyes black, and drew a red scar on the side of the cheek. She drew on a black dress that had tears at the top and bottom. Grabbed her scalpel, stabbed Henry to death with it. Her dad was out at work. She drew on her blue shoes. Grabbed grabbed her first aid kit and ran out of the house. Shasky ran over to Emily's house. It was four o'clock. It was four o'clock in the morning. She, she op Emily had left her window open for some reason. Shasky put one leg in, then the other, then jumped in. Emily was asleep, knocked out, conquered out, even, or out cold, whatever you want to say. 
and Shasky grabbed her scalpel, carved a frown into her face and a scar and stabbed Emily in both eyeballs. Recite, re-saying the words, Oh, how I felt, oh, how I felt. Some say if you go into to the thick, thickest, darkest, longest, deepest woods and and the fifth tree they look at in the middle would say, Oh, how I felt. And if, if you... If you look at this tree, Shasky will come for you. Hope you enjoyed my creepypasta. Um, like, comment, subscribe. And mwah, love you all, guys.